The tools you will need are an armor shield cylinder guard, a suitable clamp, a suitable drill, a 24mm hole saw with removable center drill, a set of metric allen keys and a drill jig. Check that the armor shield will be compatible with your lock case and handle set. Remove the cylinder retaining screw. Remove the handle fixing screws. Then remove the handles and the cylinder, leaving the spindle in place. Securely clamp the jig in position over the spindle as shown, ensuring it is parallel to the door edge. Using the 24mm hole saw, drill through the door material in all three positions, ensuring no damage to the lock case. Reposition the jig to the opposite end of the spindle slot. Drill the bottom two holes only. Reposition the jig to the middle position of the spindle slot. Again, drill the bottom two holes only. Unclamp and remove the jig. Repeat the same procedure on the opposite side of the door. Place the external half of the armour shield over the external side of the cylinder, lining up the centre of the cam to the lower centre of the armour shield. Then tighten both grub screws. Refit the cylinder into the lock case. Insert the internal half of the armour shield. Secure into place with the provided bolt. Secure the cylinder in place with the cylinder retaining screw. Reposition the handles and secure into place using the fixing screws. Check that your door operates and locks correctly.